guys, it's Mike from Rage Break Gaming here, and I'm going to welcome you back to Let's Play Pokemon Coliseum. Alrighty guys, welcome back. Last time, we got a couple new Shadow Pokemon. We got Mischievous and Noctile, yes. I put Quilava and Umbreon in storage for now, more so so that we can make some space for some more Shadow Pokes. But even that may not be enough, because we have way too many to catch here. Which I'm going to be showing off, hopefully, the rest of the day. Mm, excuse me. That being said, let's um, head on back to the um, dual square. Last time we arrived here at Pyrite Town, and we started off against um, these trainers here at the dual square. A lot of them have some shadow pokes for us to take. Yeah, take. We're going to take their Pokemon from them. I mean, we're not Team Rocket or anything. I mean, we're a former Team Snaggle member, so gotta snag them all, Pokemon! <laughs> Do you feel like sticking around for a demonstration of my Pokemon's moves? Yeah! I love juggling balls. Uh, I like your attitude. Feast your eyes on these babies! Battle time! Alright, now we're facing Street Performer Diego. Or Dia Diego, or whatever her name is. That big. Ooh, Flaffy. Let me see. Yep, figure this much. Alright, now then, Makuhita in Espeon. Now, switching in, up, um, S um, Michael Heath's heart gauge is basically emptied out now. However... Yes! Flaffy is a shadow Pokémon! So, you know what that means? We get an electric type! So, there you go. First things first, though, let's get off a vital throw on Flaffy. Let's try not to kill it, please. So, there you go. That's the last thing I want. Psychokinesis! -is -is -is. Yes. Shroomish is, on um, Grass-type, so there you go. Um, Flaffy, of course, is Electric-type. Ow! Quit it. It looks so weird when it runs like that. Huh. Sheep isn't normally supposed to run. But then again, this is anime, or, well, this is, um, uh, I guess you could say this is video game logic. So, in that instance, sheep can run. Booyah! Nice. Alright, now then, I think one more vital throw on Flaffy, that should be enough. And let's take out Shroomish. Diego only has two. Psychokinesis! Oh, yeah. <laughs> Hell, I'm falling and I can't get up! Literally. Huh. But then again, it doesn't even look like a turtle. But it is that fall over animation like a turtle. That's what I meant. That being said, though, oh, yeah. Doesn't matter, though. Boom! No! Oh! Woo! That was close. Almost killed it. All right. That's enough. You did good, baby. You did good. Slow your roll. All right. Let's go in, um, Snag Flaffy. And if I don't get it, um, let's get rid of that paralysis. There we go. All right. Now then. Do it! Snag Ball, go! Yeah! Come on, baby! I want that Ampharos! Woohoo! Yes! Flaffy, get to those eggs! You outperformed me! Yeah, that I did! Now you only have one ball to juggle. <laughs> Sucks to be you! Whew, that was fun. You're surprisingly good! I think you deserve to know a little secret about a certain Pokemon move. The move Shadow Rush inflicts damage on any type of Pokemon without being affected by their types. The amount of damage doesn't vary with the target's Pokemon type, so it's easy to use. Yeah, pretty much. Shadow Rush has no element to it. So, there you go. Basically, let's check out Flaffy. Yeah, Flaffy has the static ability, which will paralyze enemies if they physically attack Flaffy. Isn't that cool? Flaffy will be our go-to electric type. At least, for now. So, there you go. And yeah, viewers, I don't know why they added ribbons. I'm assuming they have some function or other. I don't recall there being Pokemon contests in this in this game. So, there you go. Otherwise than that, though, we got Flaffy. So, let's go and, um... Makuhita's heart gauge is, is basically empty now. So, yeah, he'll be able to, um... You know, deal out some good damage. Oh, no, wrong... Wrong, uh, wrong place. There you go. 
one annoying, uh, well, I would say this is my pet peeve with Pokemon Coliseum, is that your partner constantly gets in your way. Like, literally. I mean, you know how I feel about, um... You guys know how I feel about, um, you know, Final Fantasy NPCs getting in the way and stuff like that. It's like, like they're, like they're, I don't know, it's like, well, when they're in your way, they will try to move out of your way if you walk through, if you try to walk through them enough. But in this game, if you even glance past somebody, then they will, um, fucking just, you'll stick to them like, like flies to sandpaper or some shit. And it, it makes it really hard to get past them. Like, move the fuck out the way. Huh. <sighs> Whatever. That being said, though, but yeah, unfortunately, since there's no Pokemon Center, we gotta stay at this crappy-ass hotel. Oh, well. And you gotta pay, just like in a Final Fantasy game. So, there you go. What? Did you think all your room and board in, a Poke in Pokemon games were totally free? <laughs> oh, no. They go on your tab. So, there you go. In this game, it's just a little bit more realistic. Nurse Joy keeps the tab, by the way, for you. So, by the end of the game, you have to pay like 10,000 Poké Dollars because you stayed at pretty much every Pokémon Center in the region. So, there you go. Looking at you, Owen! Otherwise than that, though, <laughs> I'm just kidding. If you try talking to anyone in the dual square, there's only one answer. And that's... Battle Time! Alright, now, Ryder Libra. Uh... Her team's not that impressive. Uh, it's kind of mad now that I think about it. Yeah, Skip Loon, odd as you cares. That being said, though, that's beyond mischievous, baby! Now we get to see her in action. Now then. Yes, yeah, Skip Loon is a Shadow Poke. But unfortunately, I really don't care much for it. So, there you go. In fact,. Skip Loon is pretty much the only Shadow Pokemon in this town that I could really give two shits about. <laughs> so, there you go. Psychokinesis! Although, for the sake of completion, I will capture it. So, there you go. Oh man, can hyper mode. Oh well. Stop hitting yourself! Stop hitting yourself! <laughs> But yeah, not every Shadow Pokemon I'm gonna go about, um, trying to purify them. I mean, some are good, some are not so good. Like Skiploon, for example. Now, if it was a Jump Bluff, maybe. But, nah, Skiploon's stats are just way too terrible. So, I'm probably not going to bother. <laughs> so, oh wait, 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 no, no, don't target because it's still confused. I don't want to kill it by accident. Mr. Venice! That's my girl. Alright. Now then. Psychokinesis. Yes. One hit KO! <laughs> Was that like honest to the chance against me anyway, so. Yeah. Oh well. <sighs> Alright, now we got Dust Ox. Dust Tox is um poison or bug slash poison type. So there you go. Now, I'm going to try and get off in the tag and see if I can capture it. If I don't end up getting it, oh well. I mean, getting Skip Loon is not really, you know, on my highest priority list. I'm just getting it because it's there. So, there you go. Alright, let's get Dust Ducks out the way. Um, I'm afraid I'm going to end up killing it. So, let's try and go for a Great Ball Capture and see if I get lucky. If not, well, we'll just try again later. Now, Snack Ball, go! Come on, baby. Oh, come on! Uh, troll, 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 troll! Uh, son of a bitch. Uh, whatever. Ow! Quit it. Dude! Okay, you know what? Okay. I really wish I had Shadow Ball for Mistress. I could just knock out that fucking Dust Ox. Son of a bitch! 
I'll fast forward to the capture. Be right back. Alrighty, viewers, I'm back. Holy cow. Let's catch this bitch already. Now, round two. Ah. This time I'm getting it for sure. Come on, baby. Woohoo! Skip Loon, get to those A. Nice. Alright, now we can finally get through this battle. Viewers, can you believe that Skip Loon kept on constantly spamming sleep powder on me? On Espeon, when I was trying to get rid of Dust Ox, as if it knew what I was trying to do. Fucking A! Ow! Bitch. Okay, you're dead now. Goodbye. Boom! Finish it off! Now! Psycho Kinesis! This confusion had your name on it for a long time, Dust Ox. Yeah, but your idiot partner kept on um, trolling me with sleep powder. Not this time! Ha ha! <laughs> Whew. That was one of the most fucking annoying um, shadow battles ever. Yet, that is. Oh, that was an incredible battle. I simply love strong guys. That's love. L-O-V-E. S-M-R-T. Yes. <laughs> if you ever get the urge to battle with me again, I'll always be here for you, honey. Oh, well, thanks, I, I guess. Maybe we can battle with her and get some free EXP next time. So, there you go. In any case, we got Skip Loon. Um, let's see here. Skip Loon has the chlorophyll ability, which rates its speed if it's sunny out. So, if you have sunny day on the field, then, well, its speed is going to be heightened. But, uh, with Grassland's flying type, I, don't, I mean, it's not a bad type. It's just extremely weak to ice. So, you know, there's that. Now, Mischievous's heart gauge is almost empty. Almost. I think we got one more Shadow Pokemon in this particular square. Talk to this guy. Huh? You want to battle me? Yes, I do. Sure thing. Battling fans are always welcome at the House of Pain. Battle time. All right, now we got Bandana Guy Devil. Let's see. His team is... Ooh, nice. Okay. Yeah, 29. You know what that means? Viewers, take a well guess which one of those water types is the Shadow Pokemon. Yeah, Quagsire! Woohoo! Quagsire is Water Slash Ground type at that. So, getting that baby will be really good. So, there you go. Alright, I hope this doesn't kill it. Because Quagsire has a lot of defense. Yeah, you see that? Confused didn't even do that much. Shadow Rush! Alright, that might be enough. Hopefully. I'm not even worried about Psyduck. It's not even a threat to me. So, yeah. Oh, let's see here. Psyduck is pure water type. So, there you go. You dare try to slam my mischievous? Oh, hell no. Uh-uh. Hell to the no. I'll try return and hope that it doesn't kill it. Because I seriously doubt I'm going to get it on the next capture if I try to do it now. Yes, okay, that's that's more than good enough. King Hyper Mode! Ow! Quit it. Alright, luckily though, Devil only has two Pokemon on him, so... Once we get Quagsire, Psyduck is basically down anyway, so it's not even a threat. Alright, now let's go for a great ball to capture Quagsire. And let's get Mr. Riz out of that. But first things first. Stack ball, go! Ah! Feels like it feels like I'm grunting when I say that. Ah! Uh, huh! Ah! Uh, I mean, ah! Uh, yeah! Woohoo! Nice! Mr. Riz! There you go, baby. Alright, we got Quagsire. All we gotta do now is get this bitch out the way. Why do you use normal moves on a ghost type? Are you stupid? Huh, dumbass. Whatever. Oh, we got Mean Look. I didn't even notice that. Mean Look will prevent a Pokemon from switching out. That might be useful later. Probably not. Psychokinesis! 
Mischievous, so are you, baby. Finish the duck off. And duck soup! Oh, yeah. Ow. You can't have, you can't have any fun without a little pain. Right, Psyduck? <laughs> Psy, Psy. Duck. Duck! <laughs> wow, well, my Pokemon! Yeah, basically. I'd be crying in agony too if I just got my Pokemon stolen by some random dude. <laughs> and probably wasn't feeling the urge to kick ass. You're way tough. We gotta battle again. Yeah, but not this time. I would I would re I would rebattle you right now, but no. No. It's, I mean it's not a total GG no re, but not right now. That being said though, on um, Quagsire, like I said, Water Slash Ground makes it have perfect immunity around electric type moves. It has the damp ability which prevents self-destruction. So moves like if you try to use self-destruct or explosion on it, ain't working. So there you go. Otherwise than that though, um yeah, we just have to unlock its moves. Quagsire will be my go-to water type. For now. Anyway. So basically what I want to do now. Um, there is a, I think there's another guy here in town somewhere. Um, oh, is this the guy? How's it going? Battle, battle, so much fun. Pokemon battles for everyone. Battles bring me so much joy. Let's get started, little boy. Hey, that rhymed. Cool. <laughs> in any case, battle time versus Roller Boy Leon. All right, where's he at? Oh, his team is really diverse. Well, sort of. No, well, by diverse, I mean he has a lot of them. Like four! Now then! <sighs> Who's our Shadow Pokemon? Slugma! Yes! But seeing as I already have Quilava already, I really don't need Slugma. So, I'm just gonna... Well, I will capture it, though. So, there you go. Let's get started. Psycho Kinesis! Yeah! Whoa! Okay! That's enough, that's enough. Chill your roll, baby. There you go. Ah, fucking hyper mode. Please don't hit mischievous! I said not to miss hit hit mischievous! Bitch! Ah! Damn it! Alright, um this matter of fact, now's a good chance to give Flaffy some action. So there you go. Go, baby! All right. Not like water guns gonna do much to me anyway. <laughs> Quit it! That tickles. <laughs> All right. Now, first things first. Oh, as a matter of fact, um, you know what? Let's, let's just go and get Slugman now. It's already weekend anyway. Mine as well. And then I'll um revive um um who got KO'd again? Mischievous. <laughs> fail. My memory sucks! If you didn't know that by now. Now! Snag ball, go! <laughs> Bring that heat, baby! One. Yes! Woohoo! Slugma, get to those eggs! And whenever you have a full team already and you catch your shadow Pokemon, it'll go right to your, um, your PC storage. So, there you go. Just like in pretty much any Pokemon game, when you have a full team of six, and you capture an additional Pokemon, yeah, that's pretty much the result. Alright, um... Hmm. Mr. Vince's Heart Gauge is on... No, not don't call it out. Mr. Vince's Heart Gauge is almost emptied out. So, let's go and switch it out. We'll switch it in. Or, switch it back in, I should say. Yeah. Come back in. Uh, come back in. Oh, there you go. Then almost... I almost misconstrued that, um, that statement. Now, Shadow Rush! Boom! Flaffy still looks weird when it when it does that. Sheep cannot walk on their, on their front legs. Or hind legs, or... Whatever legs Flaffy has. Huh. Why do these people keep using normal moves on my ghost type? Like, what's in it for them? Whatever. I don't mind shadow rushing you to death. That's how I roll! Ah! Yeah! The game must have felt my passion just now and gave me a critical hit. 
Critical hits pop out of nowhere, especially when you're like really into the battle. If you connect with your Pokemon viewers, you can overcome anything. And I mean anything. <laughs> that Elite Four member got you down? That dude. You can kick his ass. He ain't tough. I can take that. You can take that, bitch. Yeah. Can't beat me. Mr. Miss. That's my girl. Now then. Let's try this. Uh. Uh. See, this is what happens when you have multiple Shadow Pokemon in your party. You have like multi hyper um hyper modes. It can get annoying really fast. All right, now let's try this again. Oh, we got a Shadow Ball! Perfect timing. All right, let's go with that on on Swap Blue. Ruffy! Yay! <laughs> just wait, just wait till Flaffy evolves. What the? All oh, right, Swap Blue was normal slash flying. How the fuck did I forget that? Wow, I raised a fucking Altaria in my Pokemon Platinum walkthrough. How the hell did I forget that? Wow, I suck. <laughs> How did I forget that shit? Wow. Whatever. Booyah! Whew. Oh well, like I said, I don't mind Shadow rushing to death. They don't get the job done too. I just wish I could have Shadow Balled them to death. Boom! Oh yeah. Ow! Quit it. But yeah, it's like... Uh oh! Mr. Venice! Damn it! Maybe I should have healed her before um, the, that last round. Whatever. That being said, then let's switch to Quagsire now and give him some screen time. Go, Quagsire! Yay! Alright. Um, Shadow Rush. And let's revive um, Mischievous. Now, as I mentioned a few episodes ago, um, even though the Shadow Pokemon are not getting EXP right now, or it doesn't look like they're getting EXP. They are getting EXP. It's accumul it's gonna it's accumulating every time well you win battles. So there you go. And they get EXP normally. Like if they were normal Pokemon, they get EXP. So there you go. Later on, when we get them fully purified and stuff like that, uh, they will gain all the levels and abilities and moves and even evolve and stuff like that. Um, based on the amount of EXP that you collected for them since you, well, you caught them. So, there you go. Until next week, goodbye! Yeah, literally, that's my catchphrase, because I'm pretty much out of time for this episode. Well, we got through the dual square, but we still got plenty of Shadow Pokemon in this area. So, but where are they all coming from? And, what's the deal with this ducking guy? Is there some way to figure out... How to stop the influx of Shadow Pokemon in this town? Find out next time! If you guys enjoy, you know what to do. Hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel for more gaming vids from me. And of course, hit the bell icon to stay notified of my vids. Got something to say? Leave a comment. Till next time, this is Mike from Rage Break Gaming, and I hope your rage breaks. Have a great day. Smell you later!